In December, Mariner 2 was closing in fast on Venus, but it was in a precarious state. Portions of the spacecraft were overheating. Several critical telemetry sensors had stopped working altogether. It was taking all the energy the solar panels could produce to keep the spacecraft functioning. On December 14th, Mariner 2 made its closest approach to Venus, flying by at a distance of 20,000 miles. In Pasadena, a steady stream of science data came pouring back as audible sounds throughout mission control. Scientists were elated, although most of the results were more confirmations than new discoveries. There was no onboard camera, so there were no pictures. There was also no sign of a magnetic field or a radiation belt like Earth's. For a planet considered Earth's twin for its size and near proximity, Venus revealed itself to be a hellish world filled with carbon dioxide and where surface temperatures are hot enough to melt lead.